what are you waiting for? There's beer to be drank. Let's get going. Hey, what's up, everybody? I got another one for my birthday stash that someone got me a six pack. Um, and I can't wait to tear into it. Uh, I've seen this before and I never got it. I don't know why. I don't know. I just, but, but they got it for me. Hey, before I open it, hey, don't let, 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 let the rush stuff here. We got Deschutes Brewery uh, Inversion IPA. Uh, uh, go to DeschutesBrewery.com. Bottle conditioned to keep your beer fresh and enhance the flavors of brewers intended. This may leave a fine layer of yeast in the bottom of the bottle. Oh crap. It's gonna cause an infection. No. I can't see anything. It's kind of clear through the bottle, but I don't know. I don't care. Wait. Six point eight percent. Uh that's it! This one does really well. If you want to be careful, how, if you want to use your lids, it works really well. It doesn't damage them too damn much. Looks like that settling might have came up because this is freaking cloudy as hell. Oh, not much. Not much. Ooh, I smell it. it smells like ass. No. Oh, okay. It smells really like uh, berries. With wheat, almost it, it smells a lot of wheat. Yeah, uh, a little bit. I may, I may be off base here. Um, Sam Adams cherry wheat. I don't know. I don't know. It smells like cornflakes. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Um, that's very, that's, that's probably one of the cloudiest damn beers. It's like, someone put a clump of dirt in there and mixed it up. I don't know. But it's, uh, definitely got that finish on it. Whew. Uh, it, it, it's got too much of a, the wheat flavor in there. Yeah, it's sweet. But a lot of that wheat flavor, uh, when I buy a six pack of it, no, no, I wouldn't, no, I don't know what the hell I was thinking, no, I wouldn't buy a six pack of this, it's, it's, it's not for me, this has got that, uh, raisin brand, that's probably more of a, of the flavor I'm trying to pinpoint, it's like they put raisin brand, they took the raisins out, maybe put one or two in it. Yeah, I think it tastes pretty good. Hold on. 61,000 people are air in the air over the U.S. at any given time. What, like 3 o'clock in the morning? Compared to like 8 o'clock in the morning, 10 o'clock, noon? I don't know. But there's a website you can go to. You can, you can track planes in real time. And I, I went to there and I, I zoomed in on where my... my section of the, the planet is and I went out and I kind of looked for a, a plane I think it was already passed <clears throat> but it was pretty neat uh, but this I don't I don't care for this beer um, I won't buy a six pack of it it's too weedy and a little too sweet for me even though I do like IPAs now uh, yeah it's uh, it's very very cloudy uh, I give it a six. It's okay, but I wouldn't drink any more than maybe two. I'd go to the store and get a six pack if it's worth it. Plus, it depends on how far the store is away. I might just keep drinking these. But I wouldn't drive. I'd have somebody drive me because that's not good. So, it's very cloudy. Let me know if you think it tastes like Raisin Bran. Maybe uh, maybe uh, some grape nuts. 
Always carry grape nuts in your car in the wintertime if you're in a, that kind of climate. Because it's good, because if you get stuck in the snow, you can take that box out, throw some under the tire, get some traction. Cheers.